The first time I saw you sing was a cover of Ukweli Silaha. Oh, yeah, yeah, Silaha. And then I was like, yo, why didn't that was, she? That's not even the first song. But I know that wasn't. So I went back and you were doing like this, yeah. like TikTok clips where you were harmonizing yeah. with, uh, with yeah. people. Oh, yeah. And I was like, was oh, okay. Why? This is dope. Mm -hmm. And so Thank I want to ask you, is, do you feel like identity is a limiting thing to artists? Because sometimes we feel mm, like yes. we have to hold on to one thing, but this thing is calling you, and it's so obvious to you yeah. that. So that, has that been a challenge and to you? It, it has, it has actually, which is leading to my point, which I left. Uh, you know, uh, I I I speak on it, mm -hmm. and actually, you've asked the question that you know where I was headed. I speak on identity because it's very important. Why? Um, I said when I was telling people my voice has changed and I was telling people this last year and this year again it's just like yeah my voice has changed again um, and it's not my voice has changed it's like the identity is is solidifying into like this is how you want to do this is uh, what you want to do because even you find that you learn you see like how I can harmonize a track someone's track in a way that they didn't mm -hmm. you know now that's me making it my own you know that's me making a cover my own but if you're going to sing it exactly as you know that's why i'm always like we do not need another whitney houston we do not need another jasmine sullivan they are the artists you know that in, in, the, in their own craft like they are who they are that's an identity that they have we shouldn't try to be like we can learn things from them i have learned things from them um but trying to be like them is limiting yourself especially in your writing because what you're always going to do is and now this is the like the short videos that i'm you're always going to try to not write from your own experiences you're going to and i find it um sometimes i want to call names but then i don't want to call i find it in most writers around let's say around here like when i listen to them i, I in fact one of the best writers to me like uh, you know and, and singer is is sage you know i, I listen to it's like oh my gosh it, it's like you'd want to either you know be so happy with her or give her a hug and it's it's like oh my gosh when she did maskini i was like oh yeah mm. yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I feel that you know you know and um her writing amazing harmonizing oof, amazing um ad -libs. we cannot we cannot we just stand <laughs> yeah <laughs> so um it just gives you a sense of direction and 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 most importantly it makes it easier for you to write because mm. now you're listening to a song and it's just like you already know the structure and now the words just come out it's just like this is what i've been waiting for this is what i've been looking for and that's why for me i i'm not uh i i, I i'm still having a dilemma in between being mass consumed like mass i'm not into mass consumption i'm Same. just like yeah i know something can happen and somebody can go viral and whatever but i feel like mass consumption is too draining it's like everyone just gets to dictate when you can drop an album if you you know if if it's not enough you know it's never enough for them mm -hmm. because mo a lot of people like lose you know like their attention span oh yeah we're gonna move on to but if you're really good they'll stick right there it's like how we're waiting for rihanna still you know yeah. we, will, we will still wait you know and um that's the thing i i love being like a niche like even the product my java product i said i, I wanted to be like very niche um and not like you know mass production mass whatever it was yeah. like that's my goal is just to make it better or make myself better i don't need to work on oh yeah we need a new song and i've always worked on like I don't it feels like I never care <laughs> but I do it's just like I'm I'm just like yeah I'm, people don't get um, and I don't say this often I just don't feel I'm right there like I'm where I need to be with music you know and but now that that's me who was saying that but now I feel like I've gone into that point where oh yeah actually I, f I want I want to record yeah I have a lot to learn I have 
you know, a, a lot to work on, uh, you know, on my voice especially, but I feel confident, you know, I might, I may not sound the same way next year, you know, in a year mm. a lot will have changed, but at least I have gotten like that identity. It does help if you work on, if you work on your, your identity, like, especially in music, even in rap, even in like, I kid you not, in rap, mm -hmm. yeah. 